History began in 1988, but really started in 2007, and ever since, people of all kinds have banded together to not only celebrate the yearly football video game franchise Madden, but to pick an entry as their favorite. Woo! It's pretty good, right? And don't you stand there thinking you can't have a high like this. Come on, there's a Madden for everybody! I know, it's pretty wild, right? And take my word for it, EA Sports cracked the code and has made sure that each and every Madden game is a different stroke for a different folk. Madden 03 and 04, you played for the lore, packed with stuff never done before. Madden 97, turn it to 11, this game can cure all kinds of depression. Madden 25, what did we travel through time? Nah, I mean, it was pretty alright. John Madden Football, now I've seen it all, shows how the mighty just refuse to fall. Pick any game you want, you have my guarantee, cause there's a Madden just for yeah, I know, I hate talking politics, but everybody has a right to Madden. Just ask the Madden 3DS community, those guys get it. Madden Overdrive, not a nosedive. EA Sports, you continue to thrive. What's their bottom goal? Their honest intent, providing players with pride and accomplishment. Madden CD, oh boy, oh gee, why can't these things start growing on trees? Madden 08, it's Nirvana on a plate. I don't like that one. You're a f***ing disgrace. Pick any game you want, you have my guarantee. Not you. Yeah, I like this one. No, no, no! It's just not fair! Everybody's all about to imagine this. Imagine that! People need to realize there's only one sports game that deserves recognition! I'll show them! I'll show them all! Hey y'all, Scott here, and man, what a perfect Madden day it is here in the year Madden 19. That's Madden lingo for 2018. Sure, some games may be better than others, but as human beings, we all share the primal instinct to pick a Madden to call our own. Everyone has one, just take a look. Madden 2001. Society peaked in 1988 with the release of John Madden's football. I sure do love Madden 07. Seriously, like, have you even lived if you've never experienced Madden 2002 on the Game Boy Advance? Madden 09. Madden 06 on the PS is the future. It's all Madden, and it's another one for a reason. We are here ready to play some Madden 19, am I right? You ain't played Madden NFL 2007, baby. Madden 11 on Wii. Madden 05, Peter approved. Madden 2002 for the Nintendo GameCube. John Madden Football. I love Madden 07 more than I love my child. It just makes me feel all warm and culty on the inside. It's just such a great time to be talking about any retired coach or sportscaster born in 1936. Talking about Madden, looking at Madden, trading in Madden. <laughs> now that I got that out of my system, let's figure out what I should talk about today. Uh, I don't know. I already talked about Sonic 2, what else is there? always been there. Take my towel. Well, I like both of those things, so why not? So this game is a little thing I like to call Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. College Hoops, slang for university basketball. Awesome Baby, a phrase deriving from pure joy. But what exactly is a Dick Vitale? 
apparently one of the most eccentric and beloved basketball commentators of all time. He's evolved from coach to sportscaster to jack of all trades, appearing in various films and commercials, writing books, and lending his voice to the NCAA March Madness games. Now the killer apps of Dick Vitale are his catchphrases. We have such mainstays as a diaper dandy, slam bam jam, Dipsy Doo Dunkaroo, and any and all varieties of a phrase that even resembles, it's awesome, baby. In 1994, Time Warner Interactive struck a deal to cram as much Vital in a Sega Genesis cartridge as humanly possible. And that's all I got from the game's Wikipedia article. Look how small this is. You could tattoo this entire thing on your foot. And before anybody asks, no, this game has no relation to College Hoops 2K8. This is bullshit. Well, let's take a look at the manual. Hello, everybody, I'm Dick Vitale. Oh my god, he's talking to me. How can anybody not be turned on by college hoops? We have a Dick Vitale Rosetta Stone in the back, too. I always wondered what my neighbors meant when I heard them screaming Pine Time. The answer was always here. Play and you'll be screaming Awesome Baby with a capital A. That would look fucking stupid. The only Genesis basketball game with a 3D rotating court and Dick Vitale. Sure, some Genesis games have a 3D rotating court and some have Dick Vitale, but this one has both. I can't hold this much longer. It's finally time to find out what's been sitting on my desk for the past two years. This is Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. I hate when that happens. I don't know if Dick Vitale ever made the statement, if only I was the basketball. And this is an only Dick Vitale fans will get this Easter egg, but man, I've been trying to figure out the reason behind this for the past 15 seconds. Dick is wheeled in here, screams 11 letters in a row, and we have a title screen that delivers the hardiest out there. This title screen is great because you could crop out any portion of it and still know exactly what it's about. Oh yeah, basketball, easy, next question. Now well, let's set up a game and you know we have to represent our buds down in Tucson, Arizona and who better to go against than No Carolina? Playing the actual game? Yep, the back of the box doesn't lie. That is a 3D rotating court and that is Dick Vitale. You just run around with Dick Vitale in your ears trying to get your ball in these things. I lost. No Carolina won that, who did? Warm up the bus, baby! This one is history! Jesus, Dick, I'm grieving. This guy's just eating a sandwich. Now, am I anal about losing or completely indifferent to it? I don't know, but personally, I think I'm on team anal for this one. Now, of course, playing basketball is only one part of the Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby experience. We also have the extra mode options. <laughs> Look at this, we have a sound test! We can go through all of Dick Vitale's phrases, like... Awesome, baby! And... Awesome, baby! It never gets old. Hey man, can you drop my dad at the hospital? I'm busy. So, Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. You may be asking, where does this fit in on the Madden timeline? That's a good question. I'd say it fits snugly between the Madden CD and Madden 95 era. Does that make it any good? Eh, not really. It has that awkward 3D sports game for the Sega Genesis twang, and overall this game just doesn't really hold up that- What the hell? I do not know what happened there, so whatever. Let's just forget Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops and go back to playing some Madden now. Ah! All my copies of Madden Away have been vitaled. All right, everybody, you can stop with the comments. I'm finally gonna take a look at Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. So Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops is what I would personally consider to be an all-time hooping classic. It's definitely the pinnacle of the Dick Vitale-related Genesis games with Awesome Baby in the title. Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. What's all that about? Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops has a lot of unseen and unused content in it. Hey everyone, and welcome back to another brand new episode of The Completionist, where today I'm gonna complete Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. <laughs> Okay, so this is just a wild shot in the dark here, but I assume this timeline has been altered and now the only sports game you can play is Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops. It's a good thing I bought that space-time continuum proof baggie! <sighs> Copy of Madden 08 and a flash drive with the NFL theme song on it. You can never be too safe. I think I was the only person not affected by this whole timeline fiasco because I was playing Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops when it all happened. There's always a loophole. Well, since I can't alter the space-time continuum myself to change it back how it used to be, I'm just gonna do what anybody who's in a world that believes that Dick Vitale's Awesome Baby College Hoops is the only sports game you can play would do. Dick Vitale is a myth! I like Dick Vitale more like I don't like Dick Vitale! I drew devil horns on him! That's how you know he's bad! The police agree with me! This just in, a local anti Dick Vitale nut job decides to publicly whine about Dick Vitale, screaming such obscenities as Vince Young and EA Sports. 
He's being put under house arrest, and quite frankly, we're just glad this kind of lunatic is off the streets. That guy might be onto something. Hey all, Scott here. I've heard the request, and yep, I'm finally gonna do it. Today, we're gonna be taking a look at house arrest. Take a look at your nearest ankle. If you have one of these guys plastered on it, then you get it. House arrest has been a thing since the glory days, AKA the 17th century. Simpler times, when you could force somebody to not leave their house without ankle jewelry. Now, I've recently been subjected to house arrest, so consider this a first impressions, not a full on review. This blows. Hey, hey, we couldn't have helped but notice that you've been completely rejected by society. Yeah, I've been trying to pull off that look lately. <laughs> sure is crazy what a little bit of public indecency will do to somebody. Yeah, some people are saying you're on a bit of a depression field dick by towel protest. Here, this always helps me when I'm down. No, I'm fine. Hey, you want to know what depression doesn't look like? Hey, guys. Whoa, you got awesome baby college hoops? I love these things! Alright, that is why I'm on some depression fueled Dick Vitale protest. A few hours ago, I was living it up with the big shots. Madden 94, Madden 97, Madden 11. I had options! But now all people play is Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops, really! Who even is Dick Vitale?! Not Satan, that's for sure. Why even is everybody so pro Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops? Because it's awesome, baby! He's a one dunker! dandy! Oh, he's the best. It's completely by law. Yup. This one's probably your government officials out there. I love Dick Vitale. He's just the perfect blend of Dick and Vitale. Yeah, we've all been conditioned since birth to be pro awesome baby college hoops. But you still have to tell me, what's a Madden? <laughs> All right, guys, uh, I don't think I'm from here. I think the space-time continuum was altered, and I'm from a time where Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops wasn't the only sports game you could call your own. Uh, look, I have proof. <gasps> it's a football video game franchise that releases every year that peaked in 2007. My timeline had loads of these things, all with different numbers after the word Madden. Oh my god. I just want people to know that there's more to life than just games based around Dick Vitale. I, I have a confession. I, I, I don't really like Dick Vitale. Oh, oh, what, what's the name of that? I know it. Free speech! This Dick Vitale sh has been spanked onto our brain since we were young. And quite frankly, I don't know why. Listen, there's more to life than just one sports game. And if I can't get back to my timeline, then I'm going to try my best to change this timeline. To prove to everybody that Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops doesn't have to be the only one we can like. Now those are 50 words I can get behind. Awesome, baby. We can start by changing that ringtone. Well, if we really want to know why Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops is a... Thing these days. We can just go ask our supreme leader. He lives down the street. <laughs> Neat sh I'll head out with you guys. Wait, don't you have one of those I hate Dick Vitale and I'm proud of a bracelets on? It's okay. They ran out of small ankle bracelets, so they had to give me an XL one. I can just slip this off right now and put it on a ceiling fan or whatever, and they'll think I'm moving around the house. He's gone fing mad. All right, what's the plan here? Mind wording that in a Dick Vitale context? Yeah, as much as I want to overthrow the government and all, I still can't really understand much if it's not in the Dick Vitale genre. I think the entrance to our leader's lair is underground in that hole over there. All we need to do is sneak past those guards. I think I know how to distract them. Man, I love Dick Vitale. <laughs> Same! <laughs> yeah, it is. Holy sh! Is that Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops? Maybe. We better play them all to make sure. Let's go. All right, you guys go in. I'll hang back and uh, stay guard. Dick Vitale. Dick Vitale. He's good, right? So good. It's just so great to see people who get it. He's just the, the perfect, perfect balance, balance of Dick, Dick and Vitale. Vitale. Well, you've all won me over. What can I do for you? You know, we do have a few Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops questions for you. Shoot! Why are you wearing a mask? I mean, I'm not Dick Vitale, so why would I show my face? Fair reasoning. Yeah, you guys can show your faces all you want. I just don't want to go to hell. So how did the world get so awesome, baby? Well, I wouldn't normally lie and just say it's always been like this, but you guys seem pretty cool, talking about Dick Vitale and all. 
So originally, things weren't like this. Then there were a ton of other sports games besides Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops. I refused to like that. I built this time machine to travel back in time, persuade Dick Vitale to buy the patent for all video games, and force no other sports games to be created other than Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops! And also pulled some strings with the government to make me the head honcho of all Dick Vitale related activities. On top of that, make all Dick Vitale related activities mandatory for all citizens. Man, it's so nice knowing somebody with the means of time travel uses it to force everyone to love Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops. Somebody had to do it. I'm also working on a bunch of new things, like this goo that turns any game you drown it in into a cyborg, and this lie detector I bought at Cracker Barrel! Anyways, I have to prepare a statement to the people tonight. Some nut job was talking about Madden or whatever. Psh, must have crossed over from another timeline. We'll be exterminating him soon, but I've got to tell everyone he's crazy or something. Let me just find my access code for the satellite transmission and we'll be all set. How did you get that ringtone? Not from somebody who told me all about the wonders of Madden NFL football, that's for sure. Alright guys, I'm sorry I have to do this, but you all know too much. We can't have people like you poisoning everyone's minds, especially with the info you know. Hey, hey, look, it's Dick Vitale! Alright, I know you're lying, but I can't take a chance like that, so BOOM! Okay, not there, son of a bitch! Oh my god, what a rush! And on top of that, we're home by 9, too! Alright, what did you guys discover? Oh, he is f He altered the space-time continuum and put me in this f***ing abomination I can't get it off! Yeah, he traveled back in time to make Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops the only game we can play. And he put himself in power. He was gonna make a statement to the people tonight over satellite, but I swiped his access code. The code is Dick Vitale. Wow, that's the nicest felony anybody's ever committed for me. But since we have the access code now, we can tell everybody the truth! We gotta set up a camera. Alright, what's up virgins and virgins? I got big news for you all. Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops is not the only sports game you can play. Look at this. What the f*** is that?! There are more possibilities out there than just Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops. We all deserve to have an opinion. To be okay with the idea that sometimes it's okay not to like Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops. We all deserve to have options with our sports games, and the right to pick one to call our own. And that is how you tell everybody everything they believed was a lie. Yeah, I gotta hand it to you. You really convinced me my whole life's been a sham. Well, we gotta see how people are responding! <laughs> Looks like the Wii Shot channel closed early. This is bullshit. I'm not going to let my dream be thrown away just because some straggler from another timeline wants to change all my hard work. These people need to be shown that Dick Vitale's awesome baby caller troops is a right, not a privilege. They need to see just how powerful this game is. They all need to be taught a lesson. I'm just gonna say it. I think he went too far. You fools! You thought Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops wasn't the only sports game you could play? That's ridiculous. You've angered the Dick Vitale awesome baby college hoops gods. Time Warner Interactive will smite you all. You've asked for this. He's destroying the city with his love for Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops! I hate to be a buzzkill, but I usually call it quits when these sorts of things happen. So I stole that guy's whatever teleportation base is for NOTHING! Wait. Th this will teleport me inside of that giant robot. He might be in there controlling it. I'm going in there to fight for the right to Madden 08. I don't know if I'm gonna survive, but if he kills me, at least I'll die fighting for what I believe in. It's cold out there. You might wanna, might wanna put on the coat. Alright. I'll text you guys if I die. Looking forward to it. F*** that stung!
take a lot more than aggravated assault and battery to stop me. <laughs> oh, what does it look like? It made out of blood to you? You stupid, dumb, dumb, stupid, not in 08 fan. Don't you understand it's easier to conform to society than tell everyone that Game Ball Madden 25 exists? Got my neck's falling asleep. This will be life from now on. Everything shall be awesome, baby! No! Everything shall be centered around a yearly football game franchise by EA Sports! Skin and body. <sighs> I can breathe again. Was it worth it? Why did you do all this? Well, I just couldn't accept that people didn't care about Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops. That was the sports game I cared about, and to see everyone talking about anything other than that, it, I just wanted things to go my way for once. <sighs> I didn't know blood blood that much. Oh, listen, man, I was never into the idea of there being Madden games outside of the 8th one, but you just gotta relax. There's more to life than just Dick Vitale, and there's more to life than Madden, too. Come on, there's gotta be another sports game that you like. Well, I guess Mario Golf Toadstool Tour is alright. That's the one with Mario, right? On a good day, yeah. What's going on here, anyways? Oh, the timeline's resetting back to what it was before I took some creative liberties with it. Oh! Except the explosion's gonna wipe everything caught in it from the timeline, so... Ah! Hey, I'm sorry. Maybe Dick Vitale's awesome baby college hoops isn't for everyone. I'm starting to see that now. Nice observation. I wish you realized that before you turned me into a blood dispenser, but it's okay. Well, if I understand this correctly, the time machine blew up because I sacrificed Matt in 08. So this is the exact same timeline from before, but now with even more no Matt in 08. Madden 2099 is the next evolution in mankind. I bloody love the Madden 01. It's Madden 12 for the NES. Time spent not playing John Madden is time spent being John Sadden. Madden 07. But it's Madden 13 we're talking about here. I like to wash myself off with a copy of Madden 07 on the GameCube. You know what? I'm okay with this. Madden 08 may be gone, but... At least everybody else has options. Hey, I have all these other games to play. Like, right now, I can play Jesus Christ out of all options. Well, after sitting at this desk for two years, talking about stupid Nintendo games and Madden 08, it's a little weird saying that one of those things is gone. Hey, Scott, it's your old pal sweepstakes winner announcer Jim here. It's my honor to tell you you've won our contest where you get to create whatever video game you desire. I told him I wanted to make a game called Madden Away for the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3 and PlayStation 2 and all the old platforms, and they're making an HD remake of it too! <laughs> Oh, 
Hey, Scott, you caught me playing Madden 05 for the Game Boy Advance. See, what I really like about this game is the gameplay. You really can't beat it, Scott. You really fucking can't beat the gameplay. Alexa, what is the definition of a virgin? Someone who likes Stuart Little and has never owned Madden 13 for the Wii U. Oh, well, thank God I got my- Oh my- Every time! I am truly infatuated with Madden 07 for the original Xbox. There simply is no better game. I'm gonna have to give Madden 99 a 7.5 out of 10. It really is the Dark Souls of Japanese shoot 'em ups. Sport! John Madden was so good. Where's the. Where's John Madden 2? Mr. Cat, I always believe that having a protein-filled, healthy dose of Madden 07 for the Wii really starts your day off right. Oh. Oh.